All right, here we go. Las Salgadonas, Mexico. Tribe. Back again. The tribe 2.0. Four years later. Yeah, we're coming back to Mexico. I'm, I'm bringing my Mexican choppers back home. <laughs> This is where you come. You get your dental work, some prescriptions, some pharmacy things, your vision. Vision and dental is really the big things down here. I don't think there's really much else. But everybody's looking around. You got all kinds of people want to sell you something. They're down here working hard, trying to get a commission if they take you to their place. It's a busy, busy place. Good Mexican food. We'll hopefully get in and show you our favorite spot here. Beautiful day. Beautiful day in Mexico. Get some exercise in today. Girls are over there getting ready to spend money, probably. Okay. We're at Cynthia Garcia, Smile Professional. This is where we were, I believe, 2016, where I've got the dental work up on top and the bottom, and it has worked out just fantastic. So what we're gonna do today, we're, uh, Kim and I are gonna get a cleaning, and I believe Shirley's gonna get a cleaning also. $30 for a cleaning, and they'll probably do a little bit of inspection, see if there's any other issues. But we're going to start with a cleaning first, try to get some appointments today. But they have implants, crowns, all kinds of stuff, partials, dental, bridges, root canals. They did an excellent, excellent job on me, so. We're very happy to come back. So if you need any dental work and you go to Las Sagadonas, Cynthia Garcia. And I don't get anything from it or anything. I just know she did good work. She did great with me. It was a, probably half the cost at some of the other ones around here, so definitely shop around. Okay, well, I'm sitting out here with Deb in the waiting room. Give you a little tour here. It's a small little waiting room. They can usually handle two patients at a time. They have Dr. Cynthia here and, and also another doctor here uh, today. So I got my uh, teeth cleaned. It was uh, $30 for my uh, cleaning my teeth. But I have one tooth up here that had busted off uh, last year sometime. But they said I need to do a root canal on it and get a crown on that so we can save that tooth. And I want to try to save as much of my teeth as I can. And then I've got another one back here they say that's it's, it's going bad that sooner or later it's going to cause pain. Uh, so they are recommending I go ahead and have it pulled out. So we're going to come back here tomorrow uh, and uh, get that done. Kim's in there now getting her teeth clean. So Deb's going to go down. Uh, the receptionist here is going to take her to a good vision place that will give her a good deal, uh, hopefully. But she recommends them. So that's what we're doing today. So. Once we get done with that, then we're going up to Mexican food, yes, and then we'll, uh, yeah, and then we'll come back here again tomorrow and do it again. So, if the food's still good, we'll have Mexican food twice in a row. All right, here we are again at La Perilla, La Perilla, the restaurant we were here three years ago. Back here again. 
or get some, uh, let's see, maybe chimichangas, maybe a taco salad. Just got our teeth cleaned and we're coming up here. And we got a live band over there singing a little bit. We'll get some margaritas, have a beer. And then we're gonna go look for a vision place for death. Show this, up, show this one again, page. La Perilla Restaurant and Bar. Good place to come when you come to Las Algodonas. Tomorrow we may try the Yeah, we're coming back tomorrow. We'll talk about more about that later. Okay, Shirley, what did you get? I have the number one combination. So this is a chili relleno and a tostito and a what was that? Taco Dorado. And how much was that? Eight fifty. Eight dollars and fifty cents. It's a lot of food. I got the same thing. Oh. I copied her. Thank you. Oh, look at that. And I salad. went with the taco salad. Don't oh. look yummy. Look at that hamburger. That looks really good. That's just not the mushy stuff that you get on a lot of places. That's real looking hamburger. Yes, it is. And of course, I got my chimichangas. One chicken and one beef. You got chimichangas? That's chimichangas. There's two of them in there. So, it's a good time. La Perilla. La Saga Donuts. We, we have some friends, too. Enter entertainment. Combo. Don't drop anything. One, two, just like me. <laughs> yep. Me and Daryl were the oddballs. No, it's good to have variety. You get to show well, This is what happened when you try to get out of Mexico at 4 o'clock. We are crossing over the Colorado River right now. That's how long the lines are. They go on and on. This is the longest I've ever seen them. So, let's see how long it's going to take us to get out of here. Two hours? <laughs> Two hours, the man says. So, it's a good thing we ate. So, we'll get in here in line and play the game. over there. Well, here we are, an hour and 15 minutes later, just about ready to go through the turnstiles to get back across to the U.S. of A. So this is the Andrade, California Port of Entry, and this is the cars here coming from Mexico, going back to California, or Arizona actually. Or maybe it is California. But anyway, we'll get up here once we get on the other side of the turnstiles. We won't be able to film because they don't like it. So anyway, you can probably see the people over there. It goes all the way back on that side of the building where we started from. So anyway, the group's all here. The tribe! Yeah, the tribe. Kim got her a little bear, got her a purse. But I got it for you because you wanted it, not that's, me. That's right. He wanted the bear. Somebody's getting a birthday present. It was 20 and I got it for 11. That's right. I brought my negotiator. So now I got to carry it. But anyway, let's get on the other side. Wish us luck. Okay. This is when you come in to Dr. Cynthia Garcia. You'll come in this door. And you'll be greeted by great smiles. 
little waiting room. We're waiting. And you can see it's clean. It's a little quaint. So they have three over here and one on the other side. But you can see it's nice and clean. All sterile equipment. They have all the technology they need here, just like the big groups down here that charge way much more money. So, like I said, if you're looking for a dentist in Los Algodones, Mexico, right outside of Yuma, please come over here to Dr. Cynthia. Tell her Daryl was some days here. Told you to stop by and they'll give you a good exam, check everything out, give you a price and everything before they do the work. So at least give them a try if, if you want to uh, get some good dental work done. So you can call and make an appointment. I'll put her card or information below or it's already in the video. You can just back the video up and watch it. So I'm going to get, uh, of course, all, all these teeth that I have is already done, but I had a, uh, one of my teeth bust off about, about a year ago, and that was an original tooth. And they went ahead and yesterday did a root canal, and they put a temporary crown on it. Today I'm going to get my permanent crown. So we get that done. My sister's here. She's having issues with her dental work that she got done in the States that she's been in twice for. So we're going to see if Dr. Cynthia can help her out. But anyway, hope you enjoyed our trip down to Las Algodonas, and uh, we'll see you down the road. Remember, stop the madness, start the adventure.